we're going to do today is we're going to continue with our pet peeves. What a pet peeve is, is it's something that annoys you. Okay, so if there's something that annoys you, um, then that's a pet peeve. Maybe somebody talking with their mouth full, whatever the case, okay? So that, again, is something that annoys you. That's what we'll be talking about. As we do that, we'll discuss the different things that might annoy you, and we'll learn new vocabulary as we go along, okay? So looking forward to seeing you in class. Uh, feel free to join. Also, too, for those of you that want to secure your seat in class, what you can do is you can get reservations. Let me put this up on the screen, you know. So here we are. So, okay, so in here, the first two minutes in here are for premium account users um, and also those that have reservations. You can go here to get reservations, okay? All right, if you'd like to. And yes, people using their Blackberry in the car, but, uh, but people aren't using <laughs> too many Blackberries anymore. Uh, Ing. And hello, everybody. Welcome to class. And oh, hey, thanks, uh, thanks for Furkan. Yeah, and Furkan, I'm going to be wearing more black from now on. I think it's a better color on me than, than green and purple and red. So, okay, so again, you know, you can go and upgrade to a ver Verbling Premium. You can invite your friends. There's a video to watch. Connect with Facebook. You can like Verbling on Facebook, okay? All right, so there's various things that you can do in here. Also, too, if you want to keep up on the latest with what's going on with me, you can check out the Lingo Center in there on Facebook. I'm not asking that you have to go in and like it, but I'm um, just saying that that's where you can keep up with various updates, okay? And I'll hear right here, right? For kind of... Hello, Ricardo. Hi, Ricardo. How are you? Hello, Ricardo. Hey. Hi, Ricardo. Welcome to class. Hello, Sergio. Well, it may be. Yeah, I can, yeah, I can hear you, Ricardo. It's co it's coming in a little broken up, though. Okay, all right. So, um, what you might, yeah, what you might need to do is you might need to make an adjustment with your um with your system. Okay, there might be an uh, adjustment that you need to make in there because it's coming a little broken up. Hello, Sergio. Hi, Sergio. Hi, Brad. Uh, Hi. Yeah, yeah. Wait up, guys. One moment, so I can only hear one person at a time. And some folks are having a few issues. So if you're having issues with your with your um, with your microphone, things like that, put that in there. Okay. So one second, Ricardo. Okay. Looks like. Hi, Ricardo. How are you? I'm hey, fine. Ricardo. What are you? Doing, doing well. Doing well. Welcome to class, Ricardo. Welcome to class. Uh, is this Thank your you. first class? Is this your first class here on Verbling? Ricardo? Hmm. Yeah, it looks like a little bit of a connection issue. Okay, yep. Sergio? Hi, Sergio. Well, it looks like connection connection issue class. <laughs> so it's all right. <laughs> So, uh, so Sergio, can you can you hear me, Sergio? Just say just say hello. Just go hello. Hi, Brad. Okay. So hello. say something, Sergio. Hi, Brad. It's Hi, okay. Man. Say hello. There you are. I'm okay. I'm very okay. So, Sergio, are you are you from uh, Brazil? Yeah, that's right. Yes. Okay. Good. Yeah. Good. Good. All right. Good. I'm, welcome to class. Welcome to class. Thank you. Good. Fantastic. Fantastic. You're welcome. Hello, Yusuf. Hi, Yusuf. Uh, hello, Brett. How are you? Uh, doing well. Thank you. Mustafa. Hello, teacher. Hello. How are you? Good to see you, Mustafa. Uh, <laughs> hello, uh, Monsif. Monsif. Hello, yes. I'm here. Hey, hello. hey Monsif. Hello, everybody. It, hello, Monsif. Is this your first class with me, Monsif? Yes, I guess. That's my okay, first good. class in New York. Yeah. Good, good, good. Welcome to class. Welcome to class. Okay, hello, Furkan. You're welcome so much. Mr. Furkan, how are you? Okay. Unbelievable. So, <laughs> unbelievable. <laughs> Juan! What's up, Juan? How are you? Fine, thank you. Fine, thank you. What about you? Doing well, doing well. Good, good. Oh, Eric's back. Hey, Eric, how are you? Hi, teacher. Hi, teacher. How are you? Hey. 
Doing well, doing well, doing well. So good, good, good. Yeah. Some familiar faces, may some new faces. May maybe I, I need to get a premium because there are too, people, too many people in Barber now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, um, you know, it's, it's just an option. We put it up there. And it isn't so much that you get, it, get to be in class the first two minutes. That's not – I think some people are thinking, you know, oh, we get the first two minutes. That's not really it. Um, it's just so you make sure you get your seed in there. And then also, too, what I've been showing people let – me, let me show you guys this, okay? All right. So – see in here so yeah what I've been showing you is here you know you can use these DNS servers alright and again I have this up in the lingo center and you can use these DNS servers and it should help to keep the connection if you have a really slow connection that might be an issue but if you want to just keep your connection this works great and the reason it does is because you're using Google Hangouts it uses Google DNS that makes everything secure blah 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 Okay, it's not a VPN, but just take a look at it. You don't have to be super technical to get into it. Okay, so let's see here. Hello, Maria. Hi. Hi, how are you, Maria? I'm good, and you? Doing well, Maria, doing well. Welcome, welcome back. Welcome to another class, okay? So let's see, I think we almost have everybody working here. So Mustafa's coming in and out. Uh, and Ricardo, everything good? Yep, okay. All right, good, good, good. Uh, let's see here. Okay, Mustafa's back. Hey, Mustafa. Hey, it's oh, hey Mustafa, have you, have you tried setting your computer to those DNS settings like I keep sharing? I didn't see what is DNA. Do you mean yeah, no, this is bandwidth? No, no, no. So this DNS, so it's in here, okay? Just take a look because you are you keep dropping all the time, okay? It's not so much that you always have a slow connection, but you keep you keep dropping. So I would try doing that with the settings, okay? All right? Okay. 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 So good, good, good. So guys, make sure that you mute yourself when you're not speaking, all right? So also to – so hey, uh, hey Furkan, you've, you've been in a few of these classes. You like this split screen? A little bit easier? Yeah, I think it's great. Okay, good, good, good. Yeah, I, you know, I'd forgotten all about it. Okay, yep. And by the way, guys, if you don't mute yourself, what's going to happen is other students are going to mute you, okay? And I have nothing against other students muting you if there's loud sounds. In fact, I like it. Just don't, for those of you, don't ever, don't ever block or kick out a student, but feel free if somebody has some loud sounds, I, I appreciate that very, very much. Okay, so again, what pet peeves are, these are things that annoy you, you know, some common pet peeves, if you're at a restaurant, you're talking to a friend, they're eating and they're talking with their mouth full, uh, what annoys me is uh, people, you know, you'll be out somewhere, maybe it's just I'm boring or something, but they'll just whip out their phone and start cranking away you know, and just not realize that they can put their phone away for 30, 40 minutes, hang out, talk, drink a couple of beers and relax. Or, you know, you don't even have to drink beer. You could just be hanging out, drinking tea, whatever, okay? So, um, okay. And I hope I didn't offend anybody who um, who doesn't drink. Eric, <laughs> he's gone already. He's gone in a flash. <laughs> I'm here. I'm there. I'm everywhere, okay? By the way, guys, you should be in class. You should be sitting here in class. Oh, there he's back, okay. Okay. Hey, my man, Eric, you have the first one. You have the first one. <laughs> Shay, you're a funny guy. Okay, okay you Eric. need to read? Oh, yeah, do me a favor. And, guys, let's just talk about these things, okay? okay. Some of you might drive, some of you might not. Go ahead, this first one, the creepers at red lights. <laughs> yeah. The, river, uh, uh, the world largest list of pet peeves, thing that annoy you. The river, yeah, but right. Yeah, go ahead, I'm sorry. The, the river... One. Who don't use a turn signal? No, no, this one here. We're, we're down to here now. So we've been doing this for a few weeks, okay? So this one here, okay. the creepers at red lights. Okay. Okay, I can't see him. The chairs sentences? Uh, right here, the creepers at red lights. Do you see this? Creepers. Students, people drink. Parents, noisings. Yeah, this is really far down. Let me just put this in the chat. Okay, it's okay. Let me just put this in the chat. And you can read it in the chat here. One second. Okay. 
here we go. Okay, so sorry, for some reason it's not copying. Maybe there's something crazy. So just read that out of the chat, okay? Okay. okay. So it's in the verbling chat. Uh, mm -hmm. Bubble in chat, okay. Okay. Uh, you, you might need to, to, okay. The creep up red lights. You know, you know, those people that start inching forward in their car slowly until the light turns green. Okay, yep. So what happens is, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. So they might be like at a red light like Did this you? guy. Yeah, yeah, no, everything's good. Everything's good. You guys can hear me, right? Okay. So yeah, they might be at a red light. What happens is they keep inching and inching and inching and inching out. And then you might be going through the light and you're like, oh my gosh, are they going to, are they going to slam right into me? Okay. Has anybody seen this? I don't know how many people drive, but those of you that drive, have you, have you experienced this or have you seen yeah. this? Yeah, it's pretty. It's like they can't wait, you know. <laughs> I mean, it's just like, you know, how much yeah. how much faster are you gonna get? You try to figure out if they're on some sort of uh, drugs and or something. Just for, just for three seconds, they're trying to pass the red lights. Yep. Yeah, they just can't quite, quite get it. Teacher, uh, what, what means creepers? Yeah. So when you creep, you go you you go real slow. So you kind of creep forward. It's 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 hard to um, explain. I'm, yeah. Well, no, no. It's just a, it's a visual. It's like you know. So maybe you go forward just a little bit, then you stop. Then you go forward just a little bit, then you stop. Go forward just a little bit. You know. It's kind of like mm -hmm. if you have a dog and you tell your dog stay, stay dog. And then you know how the dogs kind of like start inching forward, you know? Yeah. <laughs> they they, like won't, they won't stop. Like a desperate, uh, desperate driver, right? Yeah. So, so these drivers that you know, they're they're sitting there and they're kind of just moving forward just a little bit, you know, just a little bit. They kind of just take their foot off the brake and let the car go forward. That's the way I drive, teacher. Is it what? <laughs> <laughs> You're annoying, Wad. <laughs> yeah. And hey, by the way, part of the fun of this, guys, is we all do annoying things, okay? Unfortunately, I, I lived in China for four years, and it was so heavily polluted that I had all these problems with my sinuses, my throat, and everything else. And sometimes I, I, I'm this next one, okay? I do this. And I try not to do it around other people, but it's just my whole system got so messed up in... Um, being in China. Hey Juan, can you read this next one here? People who clear their throats. Sure, teacher. It says people who clear their their throats in a disgusting way. Yeah. It's when they go like that, you know, and they just they just like they have no nobodies around, you know? So even though crazy. teacher so sometimes uh it's I, very disgusting teacher. Yeah, it is. It is disgusting. So, what, what was that one? Uh, sometimes uh, I heard you, teacher, saying um, when you clear your clear your throat, you sometimes say, uh, "Didn't mean to clear my throat like that." Yeah, and Isn't it's just. It? Yeah, and you know what? It just like I said. I mean, I. And I'm not trying to condemn China, but it is heavily polluted. Okay, and what happened is my my system. Like in here, you know, I had to go to the doctor, and I hate, I don't go to doctors, I rarely go to doctors. I'd have special, um, like, antibiotics, or not antibiotics, but steroids, I had to shoot up my nose for three months until it finally got used to it, but my system's never been the same. And you guys know I have this huge nose, right? So it kind of sucks up everything, so I kind of have to clean it out anyway. So does anybody... Does anybody do this? Does anybody clear their throat in a disgusting way? Like, no, no, no. How about you, Diego? Do you ever do that? Can you hear me, Diego? Hello, Diego. <laughs> <laughs> Diego, Diego, Angry Birds, Diego, Diego, Diego got an Angry Birds poster for Christmas. He's so proud of it. I'm so proud of the Angry Birds poster. I like putting it up behind me. So Diego, Diego, yeah, your microphone's muted. Click your microphone, okay? No, no, no. Click the red microphone. 
Diego. It's okay, Diego. There's a red. Close, uh, Diego. Come on, Diego. Come on. Come on, Diego. You can do it. <laughs> Click on. the microphone, Diego. Diego, what's wrong with you, man? Come on, my brother. It's a red microphone. Diego. Arriba a la derecha, Diego, hay un micrófono rojo. Lo presionas y ya puedes hablar. Necesitas que esté en gris, o si no, configure tu micrófono. Wow. She, she doesn't understand Spanish either, teacher. You don't understand Spanish? <laughs> so, <laughs> no, I can't hear you. So you don't. What do you? What do you speak? Are you? Are you Portuguese? Oh, you're German. You look like you're. Ger oh no, you look like you're Chinese. Nope, maybe you're from Malaysia. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. So Diego, Diego, listen, Diego. I'm not trying to be mean, but um, what you need to do is take a look at this link I just gave you. Okay, take a look at the link. Figure things out. You you have five minutes to figure things out. Or otherwise, we have to take you out of class. This is a very popular class. Okay, cinco minutos. Okay. And Maria, don't worry. We're okay. So the next one here is going to be Furcon. Yeah, so that one, people that clear their throats in a disgusting way, Maria. Oh, this one's awesome. Go ahead, Furcon. Oh, people that pop and smack their chewing gum. Oh, I hate that. It makes me nauseous. Yep, when they're sitting there like this. Pop, pop. Does any and hey guys, listen. The fun of class is those of you that do things like this. Okay, so come on, who does this? Come on, Maria. Come on, I know you chew gum like this. You know <laughs> you do, Maria. Come on, you know you do. Admit it, Maria. You do, don't you? Sometimes, teacher, I, I do, I do. But I try to. The, the teacher don't notice about that. The teacher doesn't notice, right? When you're doing that, yep, you're doing it in class, okay? <laughs> teacher, remember the girl from Argentina? Do you remember the girl that were chewing the gum to? Oh yeah, the two. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I think Furcon was in there too. That class was yeah, awesome. Yeah. We had these two girls, and they were just chewing gum. They wouldn't stop. They looked like two cows grazing. Okay, so so they look like this: cows grazing. That's an expression that you can make fun of people. You know, when they're chewing gum, it looks like they're, they're cows out in the pasture. Ah, it's not going to show them. Yeah, you know, just chewing away, chewing away on some grass, okay? Yeah, that was hilarious. That was that was one of the funniest classes. Mine. Hello, Mine. Hello. Okay, so good, good, good. Hello. So, Maria uh, Hos Hosefina. It's okay, Maria. I don't know how you're lost, but it's okay. Okay, maybe you're maybe you're using the older version of your iPhone maps. Okay? All right. So, Maria, all we're doing here, Maria, is just reading right here on the screen. I'll give you this uh, I'll give you this link, okay? But Maria, just relax. It's no problem, okay? Just breathe. Just breathe. Okay? <sighs> and not, no, not you, Maria. So, Maria Tom Herrera, do you have another name in the chat? Maria Josephine? Maria. You have you have two names? Wow, that's amazing. Okay. All right. Okay, so here. Um, Maria Tamarara. Hello, can you read for me? People who leave the cap off the toothpaste. Can you read this? It's filthy the screen. Okay, so yeah, well I've given you the link. Okay. All right. Okay. Yeah. So, and Maria, you've been in a few classes. In fact, what happened is, I was looking in on one of Leon's classes the other day. Okay. And I think you, I think you're, you can follow the classes a little bit more than what you try to. I don't know if you're on Facebook or something, but you should be paying more attention in class. Okay, Maria. All right. Okay. So, Maria, All right. the screen's in front of you. Every other student can follow along. Okay, you've taken many classes, so I have to think that maybe you're trying to be a pet peeve. So Maria, you need to read this, okay? All right. All right. Okay, read that for me. 
when people leave the cup off of the toothpaste. Very good, Maria. Okay, just keep in mind, Maria, I understand what's going on, okay? I'm a little dumb, but not super dumb, okay? So if you can play around in other people's classes, but not in mine, all right? Okay, so here we go. Yeah, I saw her in Leon's class the other day, and I was like, oh, you were driving Leon crazy. It was insane. You know? <laughs> and the only reason I watch other classes, I really do try to see the optimal way to do things. So, yeah, so this is when people leave the cap off the toothpaste, and it runs all over. Okay, who does this? Come on. Who I hate it. Oh. You hate it, Minet? Yes, I hate it. Do, do, you, do you have somebody in your household that does that? Uh, not that time, but when I leave someone, oh, I want to oh. kill them. <laughs> I like that expression. Oh. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. So good. Mustafa, how about you? Do you leave your tube, tube off the toothpaste or the cap no, off the toothpaste? No. D does no, your horse no. do that? I don't. Maybe my horse is. <laughs> <laughs> do, you ever, do you ever brush your horse's teeth? Yes, every day. That's very okay. important. <laughs> okay, so so do people time really for day teacher? Yeah, uh -huh, go ahead. What's that? Three times for day. The, you... Three times a day. Oh my gosh, people do brush their teeth. Do you do this? Looks like a power yes. drill. Wow. <laughs> okay, so so okay, so mass. Let's go on to the next one here, guys. Um, let's see who's next. Oh, Minnie, Minnie. And hey, guys, please do not be upset if there are some religious things here, okay? Even if you're not religious, you have one religion, another one. Okay, so mass. This is when people go to mass. They go to church, okay? All right? And this is just in the list. I didn't make this list up. Can you read this, please, uh, Minnie? Okay. Yeah. Um, people who style their hair drink mass. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so it's where they're they're combing their hair. They're ch oh my gosh, this is my new hairstyle. <laughs> so I'm, I'm, I'm getting this. I'm getting this done, <laughs> and I'm gonna wear lipstick. But yeah, it's when people are combing their hair. Does anybody ever anybody ever see this at church? You know, or somebody's in church and they have the mirror out and they're combing their hair, putting their lipstick on. No, really? I usually I usually do that teacher when I go to my... <laughs> you're, you're styling your hair. <laughs> which which one? <laughs> good one, Juan. Good one. <laughs> hey Diego, Diego, have you figured out the microphone? Yeah, just just click on the microphone, Diego. Yeah, just click on it. Good, Diego. No, no, click on the microphone, Diego. Yeah, just click on it. Oh, Diego, you clicked on the wrong button. Okay, well, anybody else who wants to come in can come in. Okay? Diego, so, yeah, click the wrong button. Yeah, you know, people tend to do that in my class for some reason. But you know what happens? And I'm, I'm, not, I'm not being mean, everybody. People seem to figure things out after they do that, you know? So there's a little bit more urgency. Monsif. Hello, Monsif. Yes, I'm with you. Yes, I'm with uh, you, teacher. I'm with you, too, Monsif. So, Monsif, can you read this next one? People who invite you out? Yes, people who invite you out somewhere, then cancel. Yeah, so they say, hey, let's go to the movies this weekend on Saturday, and it's like Thursday night, and then all of a sudden Saturday, like two hours before, comes up and they cancel. Do, do you ever do this, Monsif? Do you do this to people? <laughs> actually, I actually know, but I know a friend. He does that every day. Mm-hmm. Yep, he does that all. Uh, well, I wouldn't say every day. He does that all the time. Okay? All the time, yeah. Yeah, all. The, it's okay. You're here to learn. Okay. Does your friend look like this guy? I have. Uh, <laughs> no. no. I, have okay, few, I have a few friends like a, uh, like this guy, <laughs> like that yes. guy. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yep. Yeah. No, By the, the way, move, the, women, the women like to do that, to, to invite you for Sunday, or you invite a hair for Sunday or some occasion, and, and after that, they, oh, hey, I, will, I pick you at uh, 7, 7 p.m. He's, oh, mm -hmm. I know, I have a headache, have problem, I cannot, tomorrow, the Saturday, yep. the next oi, week. Oi, oi. Yeah, I'm sorry. Jeez, oh, Pete's eye. <laughs> Okay, I don't know why. Sorry, um, I I don't know why that one screen came up. Yeah, they stand you up is what they call that. They stand you up. 
All right, you're supposed to go out with them. Yep. And by the way, everybody, feel free to join in when we're explaining this. All right. This is one of the few classes where I don't um I don't call on people as much. Mustafa, Mustafa, the yes. next one. Okay. Yes, women this who one. wear too much perfume. Mm -hmm. Yep. So, how, how about how about men that wear too much cologne as well, right? Like you go out with some of your friends, and they smell like a girl, you know? Anybody anybody have any friends like that? No. So, Maria, do you wear a lot of perfume, Maria? Yes. Yep. Do you wear too much, too little, or just the right amount? It's okay, Maria. Um, just a little. Just a little? Two squirts, three squirts, or four? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Your measurement is really crazy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, are you... <laughs> Hi, everybody. Yeah, who, who's that? Is that Monsif? Monsif, do you have a little buddy? Do you have a little buddy coming in, Monsif? Hello, everybody. Okay, so let's get, let's continue. On. <laughs> Actually, I'm <laughs> I'm working now in coffee on internet. It sounds you're, you're, okay with okay. you now. Yeah, with as long as it, as long as it doesn't become loud, as long as nobody's being beaten up in the background. Okay, so you know, so um, so yeah, let's see. Um, Ricardo, Ricardo, the next one. Ricardo, go ahead. Um, railing on someone else to take a picture because I want to be in it and it ends up coming out of center it and out of focus. Yeah, so this is when it's out of focus, okay? You know? Yes. And then when it's off centered. <laughs> Let's student But someone like do this. Yeah, I'm trying to get try Yeah, I'm you trying to get one job. You cannot do that. Yeah, so I'm trying to figure out. I can't get a good one off-centered. It's kind of like when it goes to the left or to the right. So, did somebody have a who said student or teacher? <laughs> but teacher, sometimes this picture was funny. What when it, when it gets off-centered? Yeah. So let me see. Um, picture. Yeah. You know what? Yeah. yeah, Ricardo, I can hear you. It's okay, Ricardo. All is good, no problem. You're doing what you're doing fine, Ricardo. No problem, okay? All good. All good. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um yeah. Cutesy intentional. Okay, well let's just read this one. Eric, the next one. You can hear me? I can hear you. Can you see this? Yes. Cute oh, it's a nice word. Cute 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 to see. Oh. Okay. Cute to see intentional misspellings like with R for R. Yeah. Cute to see. Okay. I I didn't anything understand. Yeah. So I, yeah, it's just when people do dumb. Yeah, it's kind of like, you know, just like, um, I don't know, no, it's a mess, text. Uh, I'm trying to find, like, little, yeah, sometimes you have sometimes these little, little texts. Let's see what's in here. When you're texting, uh, okay, and you try to. Really cute. Let's see if in here. Yeah, you have to analyze it to understand. I think when, when you're texting and uh, wrong. When well, you are wrong. texting in the, in, the, in the chat on the on the I, the phone, teacher. Yeah, I mean that's that's kind of acceptable, though, right? We get used to that, you know. Okay. Yeah, so that that's okay. So this isn't this is just you know like if they're writing you a letter and stuff like that, you know. Yeah. The yeah. pronunciation is cute to see. Yeah, cute see. You know, like cute. You know, it comes from cute. You know, like cute. If someone's cute, it's like, oh, oh, look at the cute little cat. <laughs> Just kidding, guys. <laughs> you can never have enough cats, right? Okay. Um, I oh. had six cats. 
That's for you. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yes, six cats. I have two cats. You have two? I had not have. <laughs> okay. And you have two cats yes, have right two. now, Ricardo? Yeah. Yes, I have. Do you ever do you ever dress up your cat like that, like the kitten? <laughs> no, I have never. You never do that? Okay, good. Well, good. it's funny, but I don't think so she'll it will like it. You wouldn't like it, you'd probably rip it off, huh? They want it. Yep. Mm -hmm. Okay, well cool. Good. They like a like vultures. Like vultures? <laughs> Monster. Monster. <laughs> oh like a monster? <laughs> Okay. I thought you there said it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So, okay. Actually, I was. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. I was wearing my cat's many clothes. <laughs> you put you put cats in many clothes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Let's let's get off the cat subject. I'll I'll try not to show as many. Not not that I don't like cats, but let's uh, let's go on to the next one. Hey Juan, this is a long one. This is a real long one. Okay. Whoa. It, it says, you know, when you ask someone a simple, straightforward question, and they spend ten solid minutes rambling on about everything in the world except the answer to your simple, straightforward question. I hate that. <laughs> Teacher, how can I? How can I pronounce the word simple? Because of my accent, I oh, always simple. have a hard time doing it. Yeah. Yeah, so you know what, Juan, actually, you, so, so take, take one of my pronunciation classes, okay? And, and what happens, I'm still sweating, I don't know what it is. So, so what happens in these pronunciation classes, Juan, and for those of you that are interested, I'm trying to give more, is I show you where to position your, your, uh, your tongue, where to position everything, where the sound comes from, okay? And just spend a lot of time, you know, so you make sure you can understand how to say that sound. Also, too, what happens is, in your own language, you have to understand what words in your own language makes that same uh, sound, okay? So, simpatico, simpatico, right? I think, right? Simple. Simpatico. Simpatico, simpatico, simple, simpatico, simpatico. So, it's a little bit off, and you can see the difference. Sim wow, I don't know why my camera's freaking out. Simpatico, simple, simpatico, simple. simple. Uh -huh. So that way you learn you learn what you have in your own native tongue, and then you adjust it for the English language. Okay, so and, and it, it involves a lot of seeing how you do this, but that'll that'll be in another class. Okay, you're welcome. Thanks. Okay. Really? Yep, you're welcome. It's really a matter of um, positioning of your mouth, your tongue, and everything else. So yeah, there's a lot of cool words in there. I like this. So straightforward. What a straightforward question means, it's just really simple. You're not asking a question that you know so that you can ask another one. It's just really straightforward. Like people who are straightforward, they're honest, they just tell you what's it's, going on, they're great people to be around. Go it's ahead. teacher like a specific or a real question. Yeah, it's just very specific, very, very easy to understand. Okay, very easy to understand. So it's straightforward. Uh then we're too well. Let me squeeze this up. Okay. And then um, rambling, rambling. So that's when you just keep going on and on and on. Actually, I ramble a little bit. I'll admit that. And this is great. Ten solid minutes. So you'll hear people say this, and what they're talking about is, man, I was waiting in line for five solid minutes. Usually, it's a little longer than that. All it means is, you know, it's those full minutes. The minutes don't go by fast. Time seems to slow down. Those are solid minutes. Solid minutes. And solid, you know the difference between a liquid and a solid, right? So you have a solid, you know, it's maybe an apple, you have a liquid, this may be apple juice, all right? And then, yes. um, yep, so they don't give you a straightforward answer, okay? Mustafa, ask me a really easy question. Really easy question. Go ahead. Okay. Uh, teacher, what did you eat at dinner? Oh, you know. I really love eating dinner. I mean, it's my favorite meal. I don't like breakfast as much. I really like dinner. It's so much better, you know. Sometimes, I'll, sometimes I'll eat an apple. Sometimes I'll eat like a big steak. Other times I don't know what I'll eat, you know. But eating lunch, I'm not really a fan of eating lunch, you know. I mean, lunch is kind of like that middle middle day meal, and it's just horrible, you know. It's just like. But teacher, what do you eat? 
Yeah, no, 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 I know. But, but well, for breakfast, what I like to eat is I like to eat, you know, maybe some grapefruit, um, you know, and then maybe a little bit of cherries, then some yogurt, you know, maybe a little bit of granola, <laughs> stuff like that. Oh, my yeah. God. So that's so that, that, isn't that a doy? What is that? Just doing <laughs> friends doing that, you know? Hello, Veronica from Argentina. Hello. Hello. How are you? <laughs> doing well. Doing well. So good. 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 You know, Veronica, I, the thing I love is you have that beef sign in the back. You have that cattle. Sign. <laughs> you have no idea how much yeah. I love that. Well, no, it's just that Argentina has some of the best beef. And like I know yes. instantaneously where you're from as soon as I see that. It's like you know. <laughs> so, so good. Welcome to class, Veronica. Do you ever have friends you ask them like a really simple question and they go on and on and on and talk about everything else except answering the question? Yes, and also with a lot of details. <laughs> yeah, with a lot of details of stuff that's meaningless, right? Doesn't even contribute to it. Yep, yep. Now, does anybody do Teacher. this? Yes. And, and my, my culture happening a lot, that, that situation. The culture, it happens a lot? Yes, okay. it really happens a lot, that. Yeah. People, you ask something and the people start talking about other things, giving, giving to you a lot of detail. So it's part of our, our nature because the Dominican are to socialize. like to socialize too much. Yeah, I can tell by your answer to all of that. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding here. <laughs> that was a rambling guy. That was good. That was good. Okay. Teacher, <laughs> and yeah. one time my friend doing this with me, I asking him 20 times, and he still 10 solid minutes. He still <laughs> don't answer me. <laughs> so he lead me to crazy. <laughs> so this this one, this one, who cares about this one about a salad in a restaurant? This is kind of dumb. Um, yeah, and by the, by the way, <laughs> let's not bring up this one, okay? Just take one of my classes when you don't know the difference between it and its, okay? So just think, is it going to say it is or is it a possession, right? There, okay, there and there. Right? Uh, I know some people who are, who are obsessed with these mistakes. Is Samantha obsessed with it? <laughs> yeah. She's one yeah. of them. <laughs> yep. So, you know, so if this one here, if you're going to use they are, like they are going, okay, all right, and um, there as far as possession, and then there as far as a location over there, okay? So that's all it is. Okay, so here, here's a really good one. This one's awesome, okay? So um, I forgot who is next. I think Fur Furkan, you're next, right? Oh, no. No, actually, um, wow. We lost it's Furkan. It's, uh, it's Furkan. Yeah. It's, Furkan. it's Furkan. Okay, go ahead, Furkan. People, Can you do this next okay, one? People who carry a one-sided conversation. Mm -hmm. hmm? Yeah, so this, you know, sure. I doubt we're going to get any... Um, I doubt we're going to get a good... Is it uh, like one person is talking, here. talking, like, talking? Like, doesn't let the other people talk? Yeah. I think yeah. it's a hey, night. Hey, hey, Monsif. Monsif. Yeah, hey, you got you got to pay attention to class, you know, if you want to if you want to play footsies with your friends, okay? <laughs> you know? So this is footsies. Yeah, we I don't think show, like me and... Footsies. Okay? I think so like me and Paul. Play that. Okay, what's that? I think like me and Paul, when we playing selling a uh, seller playing game, he will be good, and I can't, <laughs> I can't act like he. <laughs> so it's one side. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So I mean, it can be that way, but that's because you're letting him dominate you. Don't let Paul dominate. You, <laughs> all right. So, <laughs> is anybody like this? It's okay. Just come on. Somebody admit. Somebody has to be like this. Are you like this, Ricardo? Do you have one-sided conversations? Well, uh, actually, I don't understand very well what, what it means. So what it means is you're talking to somebody else, but you're like the only one who's speaking. The other person doesn't have any time. You know, you don't let them oh, talk. Okay. Yeah. Minnie, do you have any friends like that that give you like a one-sided conversation? Yes, I have some friends like that. What what do you do, what do you do when you when they're around and they're doing that? You just kind of just um, ignore them. I try to you know ignore them and I try to keep distance as soon as possible. As soon as possible. <laughs> yeah, very good, very good. <laughs> <laughs> All 
I love you. Really like What's that? I hate it because when I do speak and she, or she wants to speak, she say, uh, we need to talk with something. Uh, we can't to talk. And she always uh, talk and talk and talk and you never say anything. And she says all the time. Yeah, you know what? That's, like, that's it. Yeah, you know there's a book, Men Are From Mars, Women Are From Venus, Ricardo. You, you have to understand if you're going to make it life as a man, you have to be a good listener, okay? All right? You know, men, men and women are different. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just telling you, Ricardo. That's the facts. That is not true, Brett. What's that? <laughs> that is not true. I think I am the only <laughs> female in this class, and I don't agree with you. Okay, so so how how should us men do it? Should no? Go ahead. I'm I'm inter I'm interested, Minnie. Go ahead. Some men also like uh, like to talk too much. They like talk. Some men really are talk talkative people. Yeah, like Fred. Yeah. yeah. No, no, yeah. <laughs> 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 so no, trust me, I agree. I agree with you that there's a lot of men that do that. I'm just saying, as far as being a man, if you can't be a good listener, you know, and really listen to the woman, you're you're gonna have just very short lived. Uh, relationships, and I should know many because I talk too much, and that's why I'm still not married. <laughs> <laughs> so it's one of those things: um, do as I say, not as I do. Right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but you're good right. Good luck, you're... Brett. <laughs> What's that? I say good luck. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but there are there are some men men that are like that as well. Actually, I'm one. Yeah. Of them. So let's see here. So Maria, Maria, are you still there? Maria, have you ever seen Maria dancing during class? Yeah, I saw one time. <laughs> Maria, come on, Maria, Maria, oh Maria. Maybe Maria. she is muted. Yeah, I don't know. You know who knows. Uh, Okay, good. Uh, Mine, oh my gosh, I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> okay, you know what? So, so we're just gonna go with the next one. Okay, don't anybody be offended, all right? So, Mine, can you read the next one? Okay, when you when you can't tell if someone is male or female. Yeah. Yeah. So, so you then know. we can call gay. No, 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 no. It's not. It's not a matter of being gay. Just some people, you know, it's hard to tell. You know, um, you know if they look like a male or female, right? So I think there's. I think there's one called Pat. I think it's like in Shrek, you know, for can. That's right. <laughs> Maybe the Prince Sherman in Shrek. <laughs> yeah. So anyway, let's, let's let's go on to the next one. I probably shouldn't have let. I should have probably skipped that one. Okay. Uh, Mine, read, read the next one. Let's talk about the next one. Okay. People who leave the door open when they go to the bathroom. Mm -hmm. Yep. So sometimes they'll leave the bathroom door open to this little kid. <laughs> 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 it's okay. He has all his clothes on. It's pretty funny. But yeah, you know, they'll leave the, they'll leave the bathroom door open. Does anybody have any friends? You know, or maybe um, someone in your relationship with, where they'll leave the door open and keep talking to you. No. <sighs> no, I'm lucky. No. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's quite annoying. Definitely quite annoying. No comment. <laughs> okay, Minnie. <laughs> you go. Hello, you go. Hi. You how are you? Doing well. Doing well. We're just talking about bathrooms. You know, so. Okay, so sick people who talk for you. All right, so hey, Monsif, Monsif, are you still there? Yes, I'm with you. Yes. Okay. Which one? Can you can you read this next one? Uh, actually, I can see uh, the text because it's a little bit uh, with blue. People who talk whistle or using to themselves at work. Ah, uh, no, the one right above it, right above it. Sick people. Uh -huh. I can't see it. I can't see it. Yeah, it's okay. Sick people who cough near you. 
Okay. <coughs> yeah, like this. Yeah. So I'm sorry, guys. I'm trying to help Rosie. Or worse. Oh my gosh, I hit it. <laughs> one second. So who uh, who has friends like this, or who ever coughs like this, or who, does this annoy somebody? I'm trying to help out Rosie real quick. Go ahead. <laughs> How about you, Furkan? How about, yeah. how about you, Yuko? I know when my horse. Your, your horse. Your <laughs> horse. Your horse just coughing? Wow. Your horse, your horse coughs on you? <laughs> yes, yes. Oh. It's one bad. Well, <laughs> um, actually. If my friend does that to me, I will say, get off. Mm -hmm. get, get off if they do that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, okay. so, uh, I, see, I, see, I often see in train like these people. Yeah, but also, too, in Japan, in parts of Asia, what's really cool, guys, is people, if they're sick, they wear masks. Yeah. Okay? So that's, that's one thing that's really cool. You'll notice, well, actually, so this isn't in Asia. But you'll notice in Asia, a lot of people wear masks, you know, on trains and stuff like that. Yes, I saw it in TV. Yes. Yep. So like, like it looks ninjas. like, what's that? Like ninjas? No, no, they don't wear masks like yeah. ninjas. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Sick ninjas. <laughs> no, it's just just regular people, not ninjas. Okay. So. <laughs> uh, Japanese people also wear a mask. Uh, yep. if, people, if people does not sick, uh, people are not sick. Yep. So they don't. People wear masks so they don't get other people sick. And it's very common, especially when we had the H one N one virus that was going around. Hong Kong, Taiwan, they wore a lot of masks like that. A lot of uh, masks. Did you remember the H one N one when the, it was a uh, a new kind of um, virus and with well, the flu and something in Mexico, we well, a lot of people were were wearing a lot of masks because we we have a, a I don't know how to say a, a terror. I don't know we had we feel some uh, how to say that word. Well, we wear uh, that kind of mask. Okay. Yep. So yeah. So a lot of times when there's some sort of new virus or something going around, people will uh, people wear the masks. You know? But I thought it was about the air pollution in China. They have to. No. Hear that. Yeah. No. No. It's it's really it's focused on when you're sick. When you're sick. Okay. All right. So and by the way, Japanese people dress so cool. Yeah, I'm serious. You know, you, you haven't seen anything till you see how how the Japanese dress. It's really cool. Do you do you dress cool? Do you dress cool like that, Yuko, when you go out? Yeah, sometimes. Yeah, sometimes. Yeah. No, I'm telling you, it's very it's very stylish. Your your head just keeps turning the whole time you're there. It's uh, it's quite amazing. So very very good. Uh, let's see here. Uh, wow, people are coming and going. Um, uh, let's see. So who's next here? Mustafa. The next one, yes. people who. Mm -hmm. Yes, people who talk, uh, we still are saying to themselves at work. Yeah. Uh, I'm one so, of them. Yeah, so. I do you guys, do you, yeah, do you guys ever have somebody at work like they're sitting there, everything's silent, and then all of a sudden they, they're talking like, uh, uh, okay, Frank, uh, mm -hmm. and then they, then they <laughs> like talk about the email, they talk out loud when they're writing their email. Does anybody have a friend like that? I do that sometimes when, when I have a problem. Yep. Yeah, so Monsif, you want me to explain this? So yeah, if, I, if I'm at work, okay, and I'm going... <laughs> <laughs> Maybe sing some songs also. Yeah, and that's, that's actually whistle, yeah. while, whistle while you work, you know, where they're singing a song. Like maybe and your colleagues shoot you. Yeah. yeah. So... 
So who does that? Come on, somebody. Hey, Rosie, you're in class now. Hello, yes, Rosie. Welcome to class. I know I teacher Furkan does that. <laughs> Furkan does that. Yeah. yeah. So what's up, what's up Monsif? Do you see that now? Okay. Otherwise, yes, whether like, they're, re they're reading anything. Do it. You do that? Do yes, and listen. I'm working with pizza. When I'm stretching the pizza, I start singing. I'm stretching the pizza like that. Okay. Like a DJ. <laughs> <laughs> I, take, I take the pizza and I start stretching like that and singing some songs. <laughs> <You're> not... <laughs> I can't get fired. <laughs> do you ever talk to the pizza? Yeah, sometimes. Yeah, you talk to the pizza. Oh, then you're going to be the best pizza ever. Oh, look, 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 look at this amazing beef. I put so it in like, yeah, mm, like this. Oh, onion. No, we should put it in here. Oh, I forget. The sauce tomatoes. Oh, no. Oh, my God. I'm talking with the pizza. Oh, my God. That's my mom. <laughs> hey, hey you everybody. Know, everybody. Sometimes it's oh, so, yes, sometimes it's boring to work, uh, to work, and um, others they don't want to talk. So I have to talk quite alone. So you have to uh, talk to know. the pizza. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's fine. My mood. That is my mood. Is, that I'm is loving good. every second. I'm loving every time. Yeah. And others, uh, people who, are other friends who work with me in the restaurant, they sometimes they are angry, they have a problem. But me, I have a problem. I start laughing every second. And this make me a little bit free, can understand? And talking with pizza, laughing every time. <laughs> I'm a little bit crazy. <laughs> you know. Yep. So yeah, and hey, everybody, feel free to join along. Hey, Yuko, do you ever do this? Do you ever talk at work or talk in school when you're not supposed to? Uh, I I don't see see this, like these people. Um, oh. yeah. Yep. In my workplace. Yeah. Well, it's, it seems like in Japan people are more disciplined at work, right? You know? Plus you have large yeah. working areas that are opened. Yep. So good. 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 Yeah. So, people are so quiet. Yep. And Just quiet. Hard, hard, quiet and hard working. Very hard working. Very quiet. Very quiet. Very quiet. Hello, Raphael. <laughs> Raphael Ricardo. He's like, look at look at this guy's eyes, man. He's like, what is going on here? <laughs> <laughs> what kind of class is this? Some guy's talking to his pizza. I have no idea what's going on. Ricardo. Can hey, you hear me, up? Ricardo? Yeah, Ricardo, escuche. Escuche, Ricardo. Yeah, hi. I don't know. <laughs> I'm talking to people. I just told it to me. <laughs> Hi, Raphael. Yeah, okay, one minute. You going somewhere? Oh, he's going to get a pizza. Okay. Right. <laughs> Pia or me? What's that? Oh, my God, I'm going to eat a pizza. Okay? Oh, yeah, this, this, this one's good. It's Ricardo. Oh, yeah. He's back. Um, oh. Oh, two, Ricardo, Raphael. Raphael! <laughs> Ricardo! Well, Raphael, click click the red mute, okay? So, Mustafa, I, I think it's you, Mustafa. I don't even know who's next, okay? Freaking. Here, you know what? I'm just going to start right to left. Uh, Yuko, read the next one. Read this one here. People putting their car out of windows. People putting their, uh, people putting their feet out of car windows. Is it possible? So, yeah, like this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so you put it, you put it on the car windows, and they're driving car. Yeah, just crazy. You can do that. You can do it. Can do it. <laughs> yeah, why not? Dangerous. Yeah, maybe it's you dangerous. can control. It's kind, of, kind of crazy. I, mean, yeah, I, I did. I did when 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 my father was driving, and he he said me that uh, I I will lose my feet. You lose your feet. And he, <laughs> well, my feet, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, but it didn't happen. So, but it was fun. Yeah. Do you do you still have your feet? <laughs> <laughs> you still have your feet, what? Ricardo? Do you still have your feet? Oh well, no, just once, just once. <laughs> you just one foot. Can I see your foot, Ricardo? 
Well, I am wearing a... Yeah, let's check to make... Okay, there's one foot. So where's the other foot? Oh my gosh, I will fail. You'll fall? <laughs> I'll try. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there we go. <laughs> there we are! Oh, you beat Ricardo! <laughs> <laughs> very good, very good. Okay. <laughs> let's let's go on to let's go on to the next one here. So um let's see here. Sultan, can you hear me, Sultan? Sultan? Hello, Sultan? Wow, that's a nice head of hair, Sultan. Yeah. Sultan, can you hear me? Hello, Sultan. Okay. I guess you and Ricardo are having problems. Okay, guys, we have one more, and then I have to get ready for the next class. Ricardo, can you read this for us? When you're invited to a party. Rafael. No, no, not Rafael, Ricardo. You, Ricardo. Rafael can't figure out the microphone. Go ahead. Ricardo Cor Coronel. When you are invited... Okay. When you are invited <laughs> to a party or any event with people you have never met... And this host doesn't introduce you to anyone. Yeah, so the, the host of a party, right? So that's the person who's throwing the party. You know, so so they know who they invoke or invoke. They know who they invite, right? So, you know, they invite somebody to the party, you come in there, this is the host here. And he loves Red Bull. Oh, I love Red Bull, man. Okay, and I don't have any chest here. But anyway, um, yeah. You know, when you have friends around there and the host isn't introducing you, you know, or even just when you're out with people, you meet somebody new and they won't, they won't uh, introduce themselves, right? Anybody run into this? No. Nobody? Okay, well, anyway. Well, hey, guys, I'm going to end this class just...